To diagnose sleep apnea, we have to perform some form of a sleep study. The gold standard for a sleep study is an in-lab study. This is called polysomnography, or PSG. However, PSG is expensive, and it's inconvenient for a lot of patients. So much so that many patients who are recommended to undergo a sleep study don't get a sleep study because of those factors. In recent years, there has been increasing use of what we call home sleep tests, which can also provide much of the information that we obtain from a sleep study in the lab, but done in the convenience of the patient's own home in their own bed. The home sleep tests, or HSTs, are much less expensive than in-lab uh, sleep studies, and the, the, therefore the barrier to entry is much, much lower for many people. This results in a lot of people getting a sleep test who would not otherwise have gotten a sleep test previously. Sometimes third-party payers will actually require that patients undergo an HST before they will even authorize an in-lab sleep study. So we do commonly use them. They don't have the accuracy of a, of a sleep study, and so when there are doubts about the results on the HST, we may still require a PSG. But for a lot of patients, the home sleep test may be adequate for their needs, and we can treat them without going into the lab for a sleep study.